we're going into the into a into a tough environment, but but I mean, what what better what better environment? What better way to to get this thing figured out? We talk about finding consistency. We talking about challenging ourselves. We got a lot of people doubting us. You know, people want to say a lot of negative things. Um, what a great opportunity for us to stick together and to rise to the challenge and go play a top ten team on the road, where I'm sure a lot of people won't give us a lot of chance. That's that sounds like a sounds like a great great chance for potential, you know, Will? Well, the reality is Boise State is two and three for the first time since 2001. It's been a while since we've seen that here in Boise. On the flip side of things, Boise State coaches seem to be really pleased with how the Broncos have bounced back since Saturday's 41 to 31 loss on the blue to Nevada. Adversity when used correctly can provide awesome teaching and growth moments. And in, in this case, might even provide the team a chance to bunker down, use this point in the season as a galvanizing moment. Essentially an us against the world type of attitude, as you just heard from Boise State Offensive Coordinator Tim Plow. Broncos are 7-4 and four all time in the rivalry matchup with BYU. However, just 2-3 and three in Provo in the series. 2-3 and three for the first time since 2001, Coach Avalos and staff excited about the leadership they've seen from their players in response to Saturday's tough loss on the blue. Well, two and three is not is not the standard. You, you said it. I mean, it's been it's been a while. Have I been a part of a Boise State team in this position? Yeah, I have. And tremendous things have come from it. And I'll say that right out of the gates. And we're always going to keep perspective. We have everything sitting right in front of us this season. Our goals are still out in front of us that we can, you know, reach. And I know the way the players um, responded yesterday. We had a leadership meeting. Unbelievable. These guys are unbelievable. The 15 leaders that are in the leadership meeting is unbelievable. It makes you feel really grateful to be a part of something even during these, these tough times because tough times don't last, tough people do.